Hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And we've got a few more episodes of exploring to go. We've got to get the Nebula ID here. That's what I'm working on first. And then we'll finish exploring uh, the rest of the Undernet. Go back and go back through and explore all of the main nets. And what I need to do is figure out... That's a level 1 Spidey. Why? What I need to do is figure out what kind of folder I'm going to make. I need to be able to... Uh, I need to be able to do good on Navi battles, especially S-rank, um, S-ranking Navi battles. That's something we're kind of struggling with, with our current folder. We've been able to handle... Oh. That's just hiding Joe. Uh, we've been able to handle a few of the SP navvies. Am I just, like, standing right over top of that got M Cannon G. But we haven't been able to S rank any of them. And then other ones like Searchman and Sparkman we really struggle against. And we're going to be unlocking basically all the other navvies in the game with the exception of um with the exception of Roll, we have not gotten the uh, roll yet. What was that battle? That was... Those guys were stronger. Okay, nothing there. I know I was seeing... Ah, there's more green mystery data. We've got 4,000 zenny. Very nice. I'm considering a snakes folder. I have... Uh, it'll be in the M code for sure because I have two M-coded snakes, and I have another, like, I think it's R-coded. And what I can do is I can... Karma, EX, and Windbox. Interesting. I can, um... I didn't know where that was going. Mine 300. I don't want to do that. That's okay. That was right behind me, too. This place is interesting. We're getting all kinds of viruses here. Oh, Dark Line L. Don't we already have Dark Line? I don't think it's in the... It's not in the L code, but... I'm pretty sure we already had a Dark Line chip. Okay. Oh, crap. Okay, this is the correct way. I think this leads us up to Mystery Data and or the shop. And here we get Volgear EX... And I have... Okay, I can't use the air hockey and I can't use the blizzard in this. And I don't have gut soul. This is... saddening. I guess we'll just spam these chips. I do want to preserve that mystery data because it can be... What are we doing? Whatever we're doing, stop doing it. I knew you were about to do your thing. But then you did it in both the front rows, so I had to back up and wait on that. Um, so I'm thinking of snakes... Oh, hey, here's exactly what we need. It's Django, the solar boy. Oh, I can't, I can't just select button through this. Blah, 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 blah. 
Okay, you gotta use Pile Driver or Solar Pile because you don't even remember your own thing. I had S Sensor. Yeah, we gotta go back to Undernet 2. And then we have to go to Undernet 6 and then back here. A Bug Frag Trader. Okay, what do we need? I kind of do want to get that before we end things off. Anti-magic, not really. No. Holy Dream, we'll have to get that. I mean, we're not really basing our folder on that at this point. Well, hang on, do I have Sanctuary? Uh, Sanctuary is a mega chip. So if I have it, it would be down here. Yes, yeah, he already had. We have Dark Line Star. Why would I want Dark Line L? Shot Star. Yeah, no, we do not have Sanctuary yet. So there's no real point in getting Holy Dream at this point. I mean, I'm looking for, like, because I'm not going to be back here until playthrough 3. So I do need to take that into consideration. Not boosting my air hockey. Oh, this is the elect guy. I managed to take a hit, get full synchro, and still keep full synchro. Okay. Uh, that's nothing. That's nothing. And I think this is just kind of the end of this... area? Yeah. Because then we have to go back to... We just have to go back to Undernet 2. Which means we'll have to go through Undernet 1 again, unless... I could go to the solar... I don't think I want to do that. I don't think I want to do it that way. Number one, because I want the mystery data in Undernet 1, because it, it can be um, Recover 120 Star. And number two... I almost mistimed that. I wanted to wait for that guy to get down into the other range, but then I'm like, oh, that Met is going to get a hit on me, and I'm stuck on sand panels. What was I talking about? Uh, well, I do need to get mystery data. We do have to be aware of Kendo Man here. Oh good, the other one's right over there. It's right on the way to the Undernet. So that is a relief. Huh. You're kind of in the way. There's also something I might be able to do with the Navi Customizer. We haven't actually changed the Navi Customizer, like, this entire game. I should maybe consider doing that. Uh, so Snakes is what I'm looking at. I'm also looking at a Tornado folder. I don't know how well that'll do against the likes of the, uh... The virus battles, because I want to be able to use it for virus battles as well. Oh wow, I was not expecting a double delete out of that. That was nice. More money, awesome. 
never have enough money. Because I want to get the Nebula ID and then we can go exploring some more. I have to save because it's under net one, which has Search Man. And if I run into Search Man, I am just going to soft reset. There's no point in trying to fight him right now with our current folder. It's just... It's not feasible. And I'll be save spamming again. Wow, there's so much here that's... I'll do this. I can do this, too. Yeah, I figured the air hockeys would eliminate both of them. The Gundel Soul would have only guaranteed to get rid of two. Wide Blade S. Okay. I don't dislike those. I don't really need those because I'm not really going to make a Life Sword folder. Though if I was going to, you would definitely want to do it with Wide Blade. This entire setup is saddening. I can't get the Guts Machine Gun activated. Of course I can't. Um, I also need to go chip hunting. Make sure I have all the chips to get... to make all those PAs that we need. Cool, this is right here. 900 Zenny, that's fine. Uh, when was my last save? Because with my luck... We'd get into a battle just before exiting here. Okay, this guy. Treasure that I found was stolen from me. It was as shiny as the sun. And it's in Undernet 6. Then we have to go pay that guy 10,000 zenny. Because that's what I want to be doing. So, last time, I did not go up this way. Because I thought the other way was a quick dead-end path. And it was not. I don't really want to use the boomers here. Oh, I could... here. Because I can kill both of them before the boomer connects with that uh, green mystery data. Ah, yeah, there's this mystery data. Reg up one. Oh, okay, very nice. So yeah, I'm I'm really leaning towards snakes, because there's... There should be, in theory, a uh, neat little trick we can do. None of this means anything. Can I get... I cannot get... Okay. Three more bug frags, that's very nice. The undernet is where we want to go to get those. Oh, if we were farming bug fragments. Just because the in-battle green mystery data get you three. Um... moved at the worst possible time. Okay, and so now that we've talked to that guy, now we can go to Area 6 and visit Star, because I needed more of those. Uh, 
I mean, I'll get my health drained a little bit doing this, but I preserve... I get the easy double delete, easy S rank, obviously no battle chip, and I get, um... I preserve my full synchro. I can open this up. So now I have an easy path back to here. The only downside to this is if I if I take that entrance, I give up the uh, super drain on the Gundel Soul. Oh, this is yucky. Well, no, no, I did not mean to unite. Let's just do this, because he's going to move there. We're going to have double. Yeah, and we're fine. And I get more things that aren't battle chips. And we're not missing a ton of battle chips either. I've already talked to you. This is the path that I believe takes us to Undernet 6, which is where we want to go. And I do think, once again, Undernet 3 does not have really great green mystery data, so I don't care too much if I pick it up or not. I believe as long as I just step forward, I'll have this. Because they'll both, yeah, they'll both end up in the middle row. Again, I take a little bit of poison damage. Side Bamboo 2 in the H code. I don't remember where I was. I started here. These teleporters get me all turned around. I think I'm supposed to go this way. Yes. Because then this path gets me to under net six. Overall, traveling through the under net in this game isn't that bad. I don't think. Not as bad as other battle networks, specifically three. Three was horrendous. Uh, I have a uh, flame line that's not doing anything here. It's just nothing. Nothing means anything. Uh, oh, there is another Jack in spot. We need to. Oh, yeah, I totally missed this. No, I didn't miss it. I haven't been here yet. Two bug fragments. I don't think we have to worry about other navvies here, at least not yet. Oh, this is easy. Uh, give me your chip. Kind of easy. I could put the collect program on. Hi! Twin Fang 2 in the O code. Is that new? That is new. And we do need that for the PA. So I'm going to drop a save there. I'm really surprised how lucky we got on the tournament sequences on this playthrough. We only had the one repeat. I mentioned this before, but I don't remember the last time I played this game and didn't get, like, just tons of repeats on these tournament scenarios. Um, I think we just do this. That works. I still want I still want to collect all the money, so that's why I'm not. Oh yeah, the guy we gotta to talk to is down that way, so let's go this way first. And just see Wait. What is this? L L El, El Emperor 4. Uh, that guy's name is just a mouthful in itself. 
Um, I think we can kill things faster than they can hurt us. At least that's what we're gonna try. I'm going to invis up here, just in case I get something that needs me to be in the uh, row. Oh, we have air hockey. That will work. Well, this takes me to five, which I don't believe has anything, but I'm going to check it out just to be safe. Yeah, no. Nothing that we can contend with right now. I mean, it'll have different viruses. Always has different viruses. Uh, we're gonna go into Gut Soul, because I don't have a reason not to. It'll probably be helpful on the next turn. Oh, I tried to punch him in the face. Wow, that was sad. Well, let's get out of here. It seems like the Undernet is giving us, like, all different levels of viruses now. And not just Undernet 6. That's interesting. And see, this is why I wanted to do, like, full playthroughs and not just, hey, I'm gonna skip everything except... Oh, yeah, you guys are very dead here to this. And skip everything except, uh, just the final... Just the tournament scenarios. Um, another thing I wanted to... Oh, another folder idea I was having... Ah, it's you. Yep, I want it. I hate you. Oh, we've been getting a lot of money in this... ...in this episode to begin with. Side Bamboo 2, oh, okay. I mean, that's fine, I guess. Ah, oh, these guys are not fine. Okay, we're gonna go... That's why I have Invis preset, because... ...those Sir Kill guys, they don't seem like they should be that difficult to dodge. But I have difficulty dodging them. I do need... No effect from panel type. That wouldn't be awful to have. I don't really need... This other stuff. I may want that. For my idea that I was contemplating. And then we're not going to be able to move on. We can't even get the five evil chips. Okay, so now we need to go back to Undernet 3. Yeah, this way. We'll go back to Undernet 3. Uh, we'll invis. We didn't need it. But we do need that, because we just spent a whole bunch of money. Uh, what was under... This way? We'll have... Black Bomb D. Was there... Did we get a mystery data there in the first playthrough? And that's for the Rika scenario. Okay. Oh, 
there's another circle gun. I don't know if we got a mystery data there the first time around. That could end up being really bad if we didn't. Because it means we might end up missing something by the time we get to game three. This is odd. Oh, I didn't... That's bad. That's actually really bad. Uh, I just need this to come back. Don't forget to unite with your double soul. <laughs> And for this one, I'm just going to run back. I suppose I could, in theory, go to the uh, Sharo area in Spaceport and do that. Enter from that path. Okay, we do need the Invis here to do that. Uh, so a couple things I'm considering for the Navi Customizer is... Um, Number one, the fast barrier program that I mentioned a while back. We did we did buy it. I think I bought that in the first playthrough. That would make it so I don't necessarily need to preset Invis to get away with, you know, some of the stuff I'm getting away with here. Okay, we have fire panels. I don't like the entirety of this. But I don't hate it either. Okay, can we get back to Django? Actually, yeah, let's just get back to Django in this one, and then next time we can start the dangerous exploring of the rest of the internet. It's only dangerous in the areas where we have net navvies we might have to contend with. Stop standing on lava. Don't want to be standing on lava when your invis runs out. You won't have a good time. Yeah, mini bomb out. We still have that. Like, what am I gonna do with mini bomb L at this? And mini bomb T. I swear, this is the same as the game one green mystery data. And now we're back in here, and we just have to run this around. Okay, so there's one mystery down there, and here's our other one. 3,000 zenny. Very nice, since I just spent a boatload. Is it... Yeah, it's down here this way. kind of want to... No, oh, those viruses don't team well together, because uh, that shocker guy can totally screw up the panels for the... Um, uh, 
but for the air hockey virus. Oh, we're gonna have issues. Because I can't hit that dang spider. I still can't hit that dang spider. Well, that was rough. You know, that's probably, like, one of the first really rough battles we had since we've gotten the, um... Uh, since we presetted the invis chip. Okay, yeah, we have the cutscene. We'll check in there, there's the nebula card. Alright, and with that, uh, we're gonna start back at Yomon. It's Jomon. It's been too long since I've said that. Actually, I mentioned another place to jack into. I want to go get that mystery data right now before we forget about it. So yeah, this is a spot that apparently does not open until like near the end of the game. This one. Remember, we checked back here, I believe we checked back here after like the park tournament. And it was still not open. Haha. -ha. That's what I came here for. That's what I came here for. Oh yeah, and actually I need to go to Natopia to get... Eh, we'll do that while we're running around the whole internet. So yeah, join me next time when we go exploring with the Sea Slider and Nebula ID. Again! Because, you know, I've already done this before. But we're going to do it again. And then we're going to do it again. You know, in like another 25 episodes or so. So I'll see you then.